these Tesla battery modules, they come with a BMS boards already installed, but these BMS boards work with Tesla, not with aftermarket battery management systems. If we're not using that, we're using aftermarket Orion battery management system. We have to replace these boards with uh, these, these boards only send cell tap voltages and thermistor values. So first, we have to remove the top of the plastic cover. You'll see I have it overhanging the table a little bit. This is that, actually I figured out that makes it easier to reach both sides. So first, you peel this tape off, and this, believe it or not, this tape actually is pre-installed from Tesla when you get these batteries. That off, you flip this over, you take the front one, just pull it down, I just pull it down without breaking it, and tuck it, just tuck it under there. Now you pull these little pins out, so these little plastic pins. You can use pliers or just fingernails. Okay, here's where it gets dicey. These little ribbons here, the little ribbon connectors, these are really, really fragile. So when you take them out, you want to make sure you're supporting them. And the other thing you want to make sure of is sometimes it's got these, these can be burned. You'll have sometimes where these traces are burned up, and you want to check for that before you start. All right, so. These little clips come in here. Clip, I'll just pull that. This one. This one down here, this one down here, this is the one that always breaks. Really, really sensitive. So you don't want to put any pressure on it. You don't want to pull. You just want to get this clip. You push it off very carefully. This one, this one always wants to break. Ah, there we go. It's off. There we go. This one here is not very sensitive. You just push this off like a normal. Press down here and push. That's it. The new one just has the same little places it clips. Start with the bottom one. This one in. All right, next, pull this out of the way, put the clips back in. And click this one back in. Then you gotta put these little white. Pull the clamshell back up. Tape back. I like to take just a little bit of tape, just to, since you're reusing it. The other thing I did before I started is I, uh, right here where this fits in, it's really, really tight on the Tesla ones. I cut a little bit of clearance to be able to put those Molex connectors in. And that is it. That is how you change BMS boards on Tesla module.